brings my fate. Though that road may wander, lead me to you. Music has always been a part of Jordy Uton's life. That's why the voice coach is using the power of song to raise awareness for another part of his life, living with colitis. Uh, the first thing the, uh, the doctor told me was to try to live a normal life. And I think I, I have and I enjoy my life. Diagnosed two years ago, Uton doesn't let his discomfort show, but managing the inflammatory bowel disease does come with its challenges. I think the biggest thing when you have colitis is that you have to be careful. Like you have, you can't like go out late and then go out late again the next night and you just have to, you have to pace yourself. And uh, with my singing especially, I found that my endurance isn't quite there, so I, I try to, I try to, you know, ration my energy a little more. But Hewton does have the endurance to organize the second annual Music for the Gut, an evening of song and dance to make noise for Crohn's and colitis. I, I don't think a lot of people know about this disease. It's, it's very much in the closet, like, you know, if, if someone has it, you don't even necessarily know. 200,000 Canadians have Crohn's and colitis in Canada. Including two members of Hewton's family. His mother Tara and older brother Jamie have Crohn's. It's my small intestine that's affected and uh, discomfort, pains, you know, certain days when, um, you know, it, it's too great and you probably have to, you know, stay in. But yeah, I, I guess it, it varies depending on the person. And just as the brothers are different, so is their dad, Basil. He's the only one in the family without Crohn's or colitis, and he's every bit as supportive, urging others to learn more. It's a, it's a difficult illness, but one that I think uh, is, is, an, uh, is also, it's an opportunity. It's an opportunity for uh, those with the illness to get involved in, in the pursuit of a cure through um, education and through working on projects like this concert. Uh, this illness has brought our family together, um, our extended family as well. An extended family that includes the people who have come together to perform new music for the gut, belting out group numbers and taking on solos. The fun atmosphere for sure. You know, we're all friends here. Everyone's, everyone knows everyone. We're all like family. You make music, you help a good cause, and you basically have like a home away from home. It's a very special, special thing we have here. They're sharing their smiles and some high kicks this Saturday, August 25th at the Grace Westminster United Church starting at 7 p.m. Tickets are available at the door or in advance at McNally Robinson and the Saskatoon Academy of Music. For Shaw TV, I'm Daniela Ponticelli.